the brick then. Yeah, something to get my key down. Yeah! <laughs> Unfortunate. This should be able to kill. Alright. Oh! Super Saiyan 4! Hello everyone, it's me again, Steve Doja here, back some more Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2, and it has been a long time since I've played Xenoverse 2, yes. but I'm also wanted to talk about Super Saiyan 4 in Dragon Ball Sparking, so I'm I'm playing Super Saiyan 4 in this game to like to kind of assist with my conversation. Make me get serious, come on! Uh, I just I just want to see Super Saiyan 4, actually what will Super Saiyan 4 Goku's opening be in Sparking Zero, I'm trying to think about that, because his opening in Tenkaichi 3 is quite tame, but Sparking Zero will have the luxury of... Uh, being able to use games like Dragon Ball Fighters as a reference when it comes to character intros. Um, and not just games like Dragon Ball Fighters, other Oxus games in general, since Dragon Ball has now like teamed up with Oxus in any way. I just realized, is this the guy that wanted me to make the level 120 Goten video? I think it is. Oh my god. I can't believe he's the first guy I fight on this game, like after like not playing in ages. Damn it. Well, I'll make the level 120 Go Goten video when I can, all right? But like... Man, look at that damage. That's crazy. Um, I just wanted to talk about Super Saiyan 4 since we already have GT characters confirmed for Sparking Zero anyways. Is that going to kill? Damn, Super Saiyan 4 Goku's Key Blast damage is wild when he's a custom mentor. Holy hell. I'm so strong, even I'm startled. I'm so strong, even I'm startled. All right, but Dropout Ludo is probably going to watch this part of the video. So let me just say, I am very sorry that you are fighting me and I am not using Goten. I am just quickly doing Super Saiyan 4, and then I'll do the Goten video next time I go on the game, alright? Okay, I just wanted to say that. Alright, wait, well, oh, what's this? Oh, custom character, okay. Leave the rest to me. Uh, do they have handy cannon? Because if so, I'm in trouble. Actually, they have full key right now, so I should probably use... Oh, okay, good, good, good. Uh... We do that from there. Oh! Alright. The stamina kind of went to... Nope. Yeah, it did go to waste. Uh-oh. <laughs> Unfortunate. This should be able to kill. Alright. Oh! Super Saiyan 4! You are way too crazy. I hope he has every Kamehameha and Sparking Zero. Actually, I hope custom movesets are kind of in Sparking Zero, right? At least the character share moves between the other forms. If they're not gonna, you know, take a move. Because I, I don't want anything stupid like Vegeta having Godfist, right? But I, I, I don't mind if uh, if other characters could use moves from the earlier forms. If we can at least have custom presets for for them. Du -du -du. Oh, Gogeta, huh? Gogeta. Oh, that back hit. Wait, wait, why am I my character? <laughs> I didn't want to be... I didn't want to be my character, I just realized. What? Oh, damn it. No, kill me. Wait, okay. Uh, I leave it to you. There you go. I didn't, I didn't want to be my character. I, <laughs> I. It's funny how it took me breaking his god for me to realize I was playing as the wrong... I was like, wait a minute. Why can I hit him so damn easy? And why was my back hit so OP? And then I realized I was a male save. <laughs> I wish I had some sort of move that made me like kill myself. Now I have to... <laughs> okay, well if he's not going to do anything, I guess I'll just turn off the game. Because uh, I don't want to wait that long. And I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to get a, a free win on him. When I'm not even doing the point of my video. Which is to talk about Super Saiyan Force on Goku! I just realized the guy I was fighting had one red bar, so this is probably going to be horrible. This is probably about to be top 10 worst fights ever, but we'll see. Female Margin. Oh, on a big map too. What do you need all that key for, Miss Margin? I'm pretty strong this time. I'm pretty strong this time around. All right. Oh, yeah, they're, they're true. They need key super bad if they're going around the corner as well. It looks like they're using burst charge. Is that Beast? Okay. And we'll just throw another one. Alright, what do you need all this damage for? I am very curious, because I'm in ranked right now. Handy Cannon. That's the only real key move I see there. 
I am very surprised they let me hit them. <laughs> Boom. This is a real Kamehameha. Cool. Oh, from that far away? No, didn't work. They still have a limit bust, though. So. Huh? Whoa! Oh, we're playing, we're playing a great game. We're playing a great game right now, if you couldn't tell. All right. They only have two bars of stamina, but I still have to fight the limit bust, even if... I get through those two bars of stamina. Ooh! No handy cannon? Oh, what the f- How unfortunate. Hopefully Sparking Zero can avoid said issues, right? Because even though Tenkaichi 3 does have a few OP characters, it doesn't have as many broken core mechanics as Xenoverse. And I think that's another reason why Xenoverse still ends up being one of the most ridiculous games to take seriously. It just has too many broken core mechanics. Like other games will have like OP characters and OP moves, but Xenoverse 2 has too many things within the game that are wrong, like way too many iframes, block mashing, like all these different exploits, and then you can use OP characters and OP super attacks on top of all of that, which is why the game is like impossible to take seriously. Like there are other games that people would consider really, really unbalanced or like bads to play online, right? But so long as it doesn't have a broken core mechanic like basis, it'll always be a better game than Xenoverse, at least in a, in a player versus player sense. Um, so yeah, even though Tenkaichi 3 also had the OP characters and stuff like that, it was never, ever, ever compared. I mean, I'm pretty sure a lot of people aren't old enough to remember what Tenkaichi's multiplayer was like anyways. But uh, <laughs> I, uh, it, it, it never had anything like Xenoverse. And um, that at least that, that tells me that Sparking Zero won't have anything like Xenoverse, unless if they do a really, really bad job and somehow manage to put as many broken things that are in that game in Xenoverse. So yeah. Hey, ironically, that match also um, coincides with my Super Saiyan 4 Goku and Sparking Zero video, right? I guess I can include that match because <laughs> I did actually say some very important stuff about game balance and how Sparking Zero... Again, it's just very hard to have a game as broken as Xenoverse. You need to literally try your absolute hardest to get a game this broken. Or in the Xenoverse devs case, not try at all. So yeah. The same map for the same cheap tricks. I cannot believe this. Um, he's probably fine with taking that round start damage all the time then. Since if he's going to go beast at the immediate start of the match, then that's probably what he's aiming for too. To always take that damage at the start. Oh, they didn't actually try it this time. Okay. I'm surprised. I'm surprised they held off, held the urge to not go beast. Okay. Wait, I perfect blocked that? What? I wasn't even paying attention. Alright. Okay. In fact, they forgot I have a good back or something. <laughs> okay. The, the hit detection in this game is insane! Did you see how hard I had to make... How hard I had to make that work? Oh, this game is so funny. This game is so funny. I didn't have to evasive that, I'm just stupid. Uh oh, now I'm in a combo. That's entirely my fault. I didn't have to evasive that, let me just take it. Their health isn't low, my health isn't... Oh, they have this Super Soul, so I probably have to use an ultimate when I stand in a break them. Yeah, something to get my key down. Yeah, because they had the really good Super Soul and their female margin, so they would have kept regenerating if I tried to do a combo to them. Um, I'm so strong, even I start. Oh, you know, what? I hope I hope the characters have like the funny lines in Sparking Zero. Oh, do you know what I really want Goku to have? I want him to have. I, I want to fight, fight you, you again. again because that was like the best. That was the best one by far. And then the screen would keep zooming in on his face while he's saying that. Like it's just. And if I recall, he had that line in every form. He had that line in uh, base form to Kaioken, to Super Saiyan 3 and Super Saiyan 4, right? He would always say, not always, but he had the chance of saying, I want to fight you again, which was really funny. Like, cause like, he could, you could like TOD someone, like round start, just end them in one go. And then go, the hell? The fuck? The guy's just, this guy has his own boss theme. I mean, I think it's copyrighted music, so you guys won't hear too much of the fight. But this guy has his own boss theme. <laughs> what the hell? 
What? That was so <laughs> Oh, this map. Okay, that's usually not a good sign. Either way, I don't have a choice. Just boost up towards my enemy at the start, because I don't know what they're going for, and it's easier that they don't get to start doing their cheese. Uh, let me see where's Musa since I have to. Oh, I see time skip jump spike. That's usually not a good sign. <laughs> he has a lot of health. Uh, what else? Dragon burn. Ooh. Well, at least I at least I saw it now. Okay. Okay. Uh oh. Ay ay ay. I love that he gets to take my stamina away. Ooh. Oh, I completely forgot. Oh, you know, I'll take it. I'll take it. I don't want to lose the stamina I have. Um, I was going to say, I, I love the fact that he gets to take away the stamina I have for being a worse player than me. Like, that's what it means to... to use uh, Dragon Burn. It means, hey, it doesn't matter if I'm a worse player than you. I'll just take all your stamina away. Okay. We can probably kill in one combo. Let's see. Oh, no, 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 no. We couldn't. You wish. Ah. I probably should have killed him in one combo, actually, because he has Dragon Bun, so I'm in trouble. Yeah, he has Dragon Bun, so I, I'm actually making things harder for myself by not just killing him in one combo, damn it. But you know me, guys. I love messing around. I was going to say, if we didn't get hit by that. All right. Ooh, can't take that. How will you find? Oh, did you forget to use Dragon Burn? He forgot to use Dragon Burn. Ah. <laughs> uh. Kamehameha Thompson! What? Whoa, what the fuck? All right, I'll, I'll take it, I'll take it. But <laughs> what, what the hell was that decent at the end? There's nothing I can do right now. There's not a single thing I can do. Um, Super Saiyan 4 Goku is really fun. I don't know what else to say. I really, I really, 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 really want to play him as fucking Zero. Especially because I can't wait to see how his fur glows in that game's art style. Um, he's just going to be like, I don't know, man. You know, he's one of those characters I just want to play. I don't even know how much of that fights a game audio I can play, because that guy was blasting copyrighted music the whole fight. So, who knows, who knows. But at least that was fun. I, I had fun, even if he was just, you know, playing a cheesy build. I guess because the guy was so weird. He played like such an enigma, right? But, um, yeah, that'll be it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you enjoyed it, then obviously, again, please leave a like on the video. Don't forget to subscribe to greatly support the channel. And leave a comment down below as to what you'd like to see next. Love you all. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you all next time. Take care and, uh... Peace.